Hey there guys, welcome back. In today's video, I just want to show you something that I did. I saw this uh, announcement from Roblox. It's about a brand new feature and I tried it and somehow I banned myself from my game permanently forever. So I just want to show you what I did so that maybe you can avoid making the same mistake yourself and be banned from your own game forever for life. Basically, if you want to try this, just open up a brand new game. Don't use one of your games because again, you could be banned from your game for life. So open up a brand new game, maybe a classic template and just go to your server script service. You're going to enter a script and inside your script, just enter the following lines. I named my script band script. On the first line here, we're getting the player service and we have a player added event. So it's going to ban every player that joins the game. The way we do it is we call this API ban async and it's supposed to ban the player. This API has one parameter is the config. This config is just a data dictionary. The first parameter here is an array containing all the user IDs that you want to ban from this game. The second parameter is if I put negative one here, it's going to ban the player for life. Zero means to unban the player. And otherwise, if you put a number here, it just indicate how many seconds it's going to ban the player from this game. And then automatically it's going to unban the player after the time passes. So supposedly that, that is the way it's supposed to work, but you're going to find out later that I got banned for life and there is no way for me to undo it. Anyway, so moving on, we have this play reason here. So you, you're showing the reason why the player got banned. This next line here is a note for yourself. The, the uh, player is not going to see this note here. So false means, yes, go ahead and ban all alt accounts from that player. If you set it to true means just ban this one account and leave all the alt accounts alone. And now I'm going to go to Roblox and I'm going to play this game on Roblox because this feature is only going to work when you use it on Roblox. You're not going to be able to test this inside studio. So here we are. I'm in my test game and let me remind you again, do this in your test game. Don't do it in your real game. We're going to play. And here it is. You were banned from this experience by the creator. Here's a message from the creator. You got hacked. You got caught hacking the game. So all I can do here is press leave. I cannot join the game. So everything works as expected. I used negative one here means I'm going to ban myself for life. But now I want to unban myself from this game. So I'm going to change this to zero. Zero means to unban. So now I'm going to publish this to Roblox. And let's go back to the game on Roblox and test. Here we are on Roblox. We're going to play test. But the problem here is I'm still banned from the game. So now there's no way for me to unban myself from my own game. I'm stuck forever. And that is why I said to you to use to test this on a test game and don't use like a real game because you may be banned from that game for life. All right, guys, I think I have found the solution on how to unban myself from this game that I've been banned for life. So this is the code that's supposed to unban me from this game. Let's now publish this to Roblox and we're going to go to Roblox and check it out. I'm now on Roblox and let's take a look. Hopefully I can unban myself from this game. Uh Oh, doesn't look good. Join error. You were banned from this experience by the creator. You got caught hacking the game, so it still doesn't work. I am still banned for life from this game. And I thought maybe because I use my player, my user ID to play the game. So since I'm banned from the game, it never got into this part where it's going to unban me. So what I did was I used another player, a different player to play this game so that it goes through this code. It, it's supposed to unban me, but still it doesn't work. So anyway, that is the message for today's video that I want to pass on to you is that I try out this new feature that was announced by Roblox maybe a couple of weeks ago and it didn't work too good. It didn't come out too good. I got banned from my own game for life. I guess one positive thing that came out of this is 
I'm very lucky because initially I was going to try it on this brand new game that I've been working on with the iGamer, the developer, for many weeks. And now it's out there. It's a brand new game and it's a very exciting game. Um, it's a good thing I didn't do it on this game. Otherwise, I would not be able to play this game anymore because it would kick me out every time I try to join my own game. Anyway, in case you haven't tried this game, I'm going to include the link to this game. And the iGamer, he also created a trailer of the game, a really awesome trailer. So you definitely should check out his trailer. The link to his trailer is also going to be included in the description of the video. And then after you watch the trailer, you can click on the link to the game to play the game. All right, so that's it for today. And if you know how to fix my problem, how to unban me from the game, please let me know in the comments below. And until next time, we'll see you in the next video. Take care, everyone. Peace.